Today we're discussing five great ways to use garlic scapes, starting with scape powder. You want to find your scapes, put them into a bundle and chop them. Add the chopped scapes to a food processor. Pulse them on and off as you make a puree. Dehydrate. You're using the lowest setting for the dehydrator and you might want to put it outside because, well, it's garlic. Then you'll want to grind up the dehydrated garlic. And here we have garlic powder. Next is scape olive oil. You just want to scoop some of that puree into an ice cube tray. Cover with olive oil. And after you've frozen it, you can break out the cubes and put them in a Ziploc bag. Instead of olive oil, you can also use water if there's a recipe for which that would be more appropriate. Third is scape pesto. Again, we're going to chop and puree, starting with about eight scapes. Add sunflower seeds. Here I have horseradish leaves from my garden. Also adding to the food processor. Olive oil. Parmesan cheese, the juice of a lemon, and some basil. Combine it with pasta, and enjoy. Next are sautéed scapes. Whether you cut them into these fine dices, or leave them a little bit longer, they give you a nice nutty flavor just like roasted garlic. I like to combine them with onions and peppers for a nice stir fry. And finally, scape dip. There are lots of types of dips you can use. Here we have garlic scapes, dill, and we stir it together. If you want to use this for veggies, you can add a little cream to make it a little bit thinner. Here I'm actually adding it to an omelet. Adds a nice, fresh, delicious taste. So let us know in the comments below, are there any great garlic scape recipes that we missed? We hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe for more videos like this and garden updates. If you did like the video, please give it a thumbs up below.